With full-scale rebellion on the horizon, Imperial Senator Morn Mothma would openly betray the Empire by seeking to unite the various rebellion cells into one organization. She began by firstly publicly condemning the reign of Emperor Palpatine after the Gorman massacre which led to Commander Voltskeris leading the effort for her capture in the Archeon Nebula. However, the mission ended in failure, and she was able to escape. This led to her broadcasting a speech to rebels across the galaxy over Dantooine, which led to the formation of various rebel cells into the Alliance to restore the Galactic Republic and, along with her resignation from the Imperial Senate, the beginning of a true united rebellion. Soon after its founding, the Rebel Alliance pressed on with the planned operation on Lothal by stealing clearance codes from the Imperial Security Bureau station on Killen 71 to allow their forces to mount a successful attack on the Empire. However, the planned Rebel attack on Lothal would not go forward thanks to Thrawn, who had discovered the location of Chopper Base, the headquarters of the Phoenix Group. Thrawn's fleet then blockaded Atollan and inflicted heavy casualties on Rebel forces. Thrawn then launched a ground assault after an orbital bombardment. Meanwhile, Ezra, who had escaped the fighting, succeeded in enlisting the help of Clan Wren. In response, Governor Price dispatched jump troopers, but these reinforcements failed to stop the Mandalorians from destroying the last interdictor cruiser. Despite Thrawn storming Chopper Base, the rebels and Imperials were attacked by an angry Bendu, an enigmatic being that was living on Atollan who used his force powers to devastate the rebel base before being subdued by Thrawn. The surviving rebel and Mandalorian forces then fled the battle as the Empire wiped out the Phoenix Squadron. However, the Empire was still unaware of the true scale of the rebel alliance. Meanwhile civil war raged on Imperial-occupied Mandalore, with the rebel alliance setting out to rescue Sabine Father and Imperial prisoner Ulrich Wren from Governor Tiber Saxon. Clan Wren were able to manage to rescue Ulrich with the help of the rebels. In response, Saxon then unleashed the arc pulse generator known as the Duchess against the Clan Wren forces, killing many. Sabine led the Mandalorians and rebels on a mission to infiltrate Saxon's Star Destroyer, which was above Sundari and were ambushed by Imperial forces, which resulted in the Mandalorians and rebels' success in destroying the weapon and Saxon's flagship. The rebels continued their campaign and mounted successful raids on both Jalindi and the Fowl Station. The Empire failed to stop both the Partisan and Spectre efforts, resulting in the loss of Commander Brom Titus and Captain Slaven. On Lothal, the Imperial Security Bureau conducted a successful raid against a suspected rebel cell allied with the Spectres.